Well, if there's one area that technology really has advanced in the past few years, it's the automotive industry. Look at things like hybrids or even the in-car experience. We've got things like uh, GPS navigation, rear view cameras, being able to plug your iPod in to listen to your, your favorite tunes. Well, here at Get Connected, we're excited about the next revolution happening. We've started with hybrids, but the electric car is now becoming popular. We're going to talk with Tom O'Dell about the new exciting Chevy Volt, a car that a lot of people have been waiting for. Well, we want to talk about car technology today. We've got Tom O'Dell. He's the Canadian product manager for the Chevrolet Volt. And I'm pretty excited to have a look at this car. Uh, a lot of anticipation uh, about this vehicle coming out. Why are people so excited about it? Is this one of the first ones you can actually plug in and actually charge up? It's probably not the first vehicle you can plug in. That's been happening for a while. Yeah. But uh, we believe this is really the best electric vehicle solution because it offers a, an innovative uh, so solution to the electric vehicle problem. And the key, the key electric vehicle problem is what we call range anxiety. The idea that you have a charge, you have, you have a, a battery that's able to store enough energy perhaps to take you 100 kilometers or 60 kilometers or something along those lines and then you could be left stranded on the side of the road or you're wondering where your next charge is going to come from. Well with the range extended electric vehicle you can travel your 64 kilometers electrically and then in the event that you uh, need to continue further beyond that we have an onboard Internally, internal combustion engine that acts as a range extender basically allows you to continue along your path to your destination or get you home so you can charge again off the grid. So this is kind of like a two-in-one car. You can actually charge up and run it uh, on electricity alone, but you do have that uh, safety net, so to speak, of having that range extender. Right. The only, only difference is it's always electrically powered. So we, we don't actually use the oh, internal okay. combustion engine to drive the wheels at all. Uh, we have an electric motor that's always driving the wheels, and the, the internal combustion engine serves to just provide more electrical power if you need it, if you're going beyond that range. And with the full tank of gas in there, how long can you go? We, we haven't sized the gas tank yet. We're still working on some of the uh, arrangements with with respect to where our label values are, um, so, but in the in the range of about 500 kilometers additional beyond the 64 kilometers, so you don't have to worry at all. This is the uh, the unit that actually installs in the vehicle. There's where you plug it into. Uh, just like a regular wall outlet. Just like a regular wall outlet. So not only is it effective for charging at home, but if you're going to visit your father-in-law or something like that, you can charge at his location and probably make a deal, buy him a beer or something like that. <laughs> and that'll, that'll take care of your charge. This can carry 240 volt or 120 volt. So you've got the 120 volt unit, or you could have a home unit with exactly the same connector that carries 240 volt and a higher rate of charging. With this, um, you can charge in about eight hours from a fully depleted battery to a fully charged. With the 240 volt, you can charge in about three hours. The Volt's 375 pound, 220 cell lithium ion battery will charge to 85% of capacity and discharges to around 30%. And this is done to extend the battery life. It's also important to note that the Volt is not a hybrid vehicle, but rather an electric vehicle that uses a range extender in case you're running out of battery. So you have an all electric drive all the time.